Hey guys and girls, welcome back to some Summer Night 6 where we left off. Um, we were just kind of getting acquainted, letting uh, with all the systems that we now have unlocked with all the people we have. Now we're going to go meet Ist and hope that he uh, has found someone or something. Is this your room, Ist? Wow, it's, uh, well, completely different from mine and Amu's. Because I am the Overseer, I cannot have distractions. I have no interest in anything except watching over both of you. As a result, I have, I've heard a spectrum of comments from others about how drab, boring, ugly, and unwelcoming, unwelcoming my space is. Well, sad to say I agree with them. I mean, this is really sad. There's just nothing here. It looks like a prison cell. Be that as it may, you are both welcome here anytime you feel like dropping by, though I can't offer you much hospitality. Sure, thanks, Ist. We should probably get out of here. Let's get moving, then. Is this? Yes, indeed, Lennon. Can you call them here for me? Did he find someone? Ist, has another person fallen into this world? It's a proper human, right? I'm not going to fetch them if it's another demon or fiend. But she said, since I promised to report items of import, I have a new vision to show everyone. Oh yeah, the timing seems to be awfully coincidental. Maybe you're the one bringing people here, eh? Can you just start with the accusations for a little while? Even you're gonna make me mad. Let's all calm down, shall we? That means you too, Buru. Chicks. They never see the trouble coming until the damn apocalypse is at their door. Whatever. So, Ist, who is it? Someone I know? Remember, it could just as easily be an enemy. Mama. Former enemies, future enemies, former allies. There are just so many possibilities. I think you're overthinking again, Magna. Maybe, but we really don't know who might show up here. Especially with different worlds and timelines. I agree with Magna that we should proceed with caution. As long as we keep a cool head, I'm pretty sure we can overcome anything that comes our way. Okay, so Ist, who did you find? Human. Gender unclear. Currently in the vicinity of the plains. Is this human a companion of yours, perhaps? <laughs> I know exactly who it is. If you can't tell the gender, it's gotta be Scarol. A friend of ours. Scarrow? Really? Did you just say Scarrow? Who? A dear friend of ours. He's a crew member on Kyle's ship. Right, Kyle's pirate ship. Uh, that doesn't inspire a lot of confidence. Is he mean? I'm sure he's fine. Besides, we're all watching each other's backs, remember? So he's a companion of yours, then. Do you wish to retrieve him and offer an invitation to this base? Yes, please. Let's go get him right away. Okay. Hold on, Scarrow, buddy. We're coming to rescue. Okay, Ist. We'll be right back. Take care of things while we're gone. What is it, Lennon? You're saying one of our reaction is detected. Uh-oh. They can't tell the gender. <laughs> it's a gender-neutral character. Summon night all ahead of their times, huh? <laughs> Deserted street. Hey, it's Sonalar! I'm not gonna act like I know a Sonalar, but I remember them talking about Sonalar and how they wanted to find Sonalar. Who was it that wanted to find Sonalar, though? I, I vaguely remember someone talking about it. Let me... Ah, yeah, this is Kyle's. This is okay. So is this Scar though? Is that who they how do they call this person?
are stray summons here anyway? And why have I lost my strength? I feel so weak in battle now. There's Carol. Such language from a little lady. <gasps> Scarol? Uh huh? What? Oh, thank goodness. You ended up here? Wherever here is. Do you, Scarol? Do you know where we are? Are you with Kyle and the others? Do you have any food? I'm sorry. Have we met? Huh? Who are you? And how did you know my name? Scarol, this is not the time for jokes. <laughs> I've been through a lot, and I am totally not in the mood. Hello? It's me, Sonalar. You know, on the ship together with Kyle. I am not in the mood for made-up stories. Tell me the truth. How did you know my name? Depending on what you say. Are you really Sparrow? Or are you just the best twin I've ever seen <laughs> in my life? Well, I guess that means you're not the Sparrow I know. No, I'm not. You seem to be sincere in your mistaken belief that you know me, so accept my apology. I do not remember making your acquaintance at any time in the past. Huh? I've been separated from his colleague of mine. And when I found you, I was actually in the middle of searching to find them. And I have to get back to the search, so good day to you. Uh, well, wait, Skirrell, don't just leave me alone like this. Stop following me. You keep saying that, but there's no one else I can turn to. And besides... <laughs> See? I told you. I'm being pursued by this thing, so... What? <laughs> Stray summons. What on earth did you do to have them tailing you like this? I don't know. I need help, Skirrell. I've lost my strength and can't seem to fight them properly. It is just my rotten luck that I end up meeting a little lady popular with monsters. All right, Sonalar, your name is Sonalar, right? Listen, I need you to stay as close to me as you can. No problem. <laughs> There's a girl and guy? <laughs> hey, wait! There's a girl and a. Uh, maybe a guy? Huh? It looks like they're under attack by stray summons. We. Sh <gasps> Aren't they? Sonolar! Scarrow! Sonolar! You were with Scarrow all this time, huh? <laughs> Overly familiar friends pretending to know me. This kind of recognition is not good for assassins like me. The loss of anonymity can be a death knell. Loss of anonymity? That was a long time ago. Okay, just who are you people anyway? This is really starting to creep me out. So Kyle, you sure he's a friend? Are you kidding? I wouldn't forget something. So like then he's probably the scarrow from before he met Kyle. Someone who was summoned from a timeline in the past, unlike Bull and his group. So this is this is a scarrow from talking about I am completely in the dark here and from way before he met Kyle. We should probably do something about these guys first though. Raj is right. We know the drill. Let's do this. Okay. 
Max. I'll leave it, um, as we are out because they're super powerful already at level 12. Um, oh, Ist can fight with us, okay. I'll take Ist, I think. Um, yeah. Yeah, we'll go with that party. I can't believe my rotten luck. Scarrow, why don't you join us? No thanks, I'm not so stupid. I didn't trust total strangers with watching my back. Suit yourself. We can save the chat for later. Right now we have a job to do, if you hadn't noticed. Once we take out the trash here, we'll have plenty of time to address whatever it is your issue issues are. Heads up, they're coming. Oyakata. Can I Oyakata no, 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 I can't. Why is it going to be so powerful? It's annoying. A lot of things are powerful around here. There you go. Crush. Get up in there. Right in his face. Take him down. Big boy's down. Mmm, hang in there. Not going down yet, is is Right in the middle of this. Here goes. That should be 
be good enough. All right. That's a wrap. It's my turn. Your turn. Here I go. Okay. Here we go. Ha. Jeez. So bad, so bad. My Raj is so powerful. I love it. Comes the big pink one. I need to rest a little. Shout out. That should be good enough. All right. And that's a wrap. Here I go. All right. That's it for now. It's my turn. Your turn. Here I go. Okay. Shout out. That should be good enough. That hurt a lot. Yeah, leave this to me. I need to rest a little. Showtime. Okay, okay. We're good, we're good though. Don't worry. Um right. you're just normal attacking then. Bye bye. My turn. Oh you know what I should have did? I should have used used his um this thing to let him go a couple times and then just take this thing out with that. I screw that up. Dang it. That's a wrap. Here I go. No! I forgot that he hits everyone around him. I thought he was only gonna hit her. That was my bad. Oh. That sucks. You run away. Oh no. Okay, I have No, I hit I hit I meant to hit switch and I screwed up. Oh, uh, that sucks. Okay, whatever, whatever. We still have enough to beat these guys. I meant to hit switch to like a different character and I messed up and hit end turn. Uh. Kill this bastard. Sonolar, are you okay? About as good as can be expected, given the circumstances. Circumstances aside, aren't you glad we were able to meet up again? Yeah, I'm excited, to be honest. I mean, you remember who I am, right? Scarra? I guess it really is your first time seeing us. Yes, and that's a little strange. You don't remember anything about being consultant and navigator in my pirate family? I haven't lost any memories, so it's not that I don't remember. I just don't think it ever happened to me. Right, I would guess that you're most likely the venomous snake of corals, right? A prominent member of the criminal organization, Crimson Gloves. <sighs> Your nickname is the venomous snake of corals because you excel at using poisons to carry out assassinations. It's pretty clear that that is who you are in the place and time you came from, right? That's amazing. I can't believe you know so much about me when I know nothing about you. Huh? What? What? I think I missed something. Are you talking about Scarrows in the past? It's definitely not the Scarrow I know. It's alright. Calm down, Sonolar. We're just about to explain. Scarrow, I think I can clear some things up for you. 
Lawrence, this is not Lindbaum, the world you, you and I came from. Kyle and myself, Sonalar and everybody here, have all been forcibly relocated to this world from different timelines and eras in the, of Lindbaum. Bro, is AD being serious? Yeah, and Scarol doesn't recognize us because he's from a different time. That's just, I mean, no way. Right now, we're cooperating with each other to try and find a way to get us back to where we came from. I'm sure you must want to return as well, so why don't you... No, my answer is no. Look, you may claim to know me, but I don't have a single clue who you people are at all. So you won't trust us after we've helped you understand what's going on? You know what I do for a living, don't you? That's more than most people still living. I just don't trust easily. Scarol. I'm careful. It's against my principles to accept potential, potentially dangerous pr propositions. I'll make my way on my own. Bye. Oh, wait. Wait up, Scarol. Uh-oh. What is that? What? What's that? It just showed out of nowhere. Is that... No, it can't be. Nether beasts? Can it? What? How did they even get here? Ah, Sonolar, watch out! Get away from them! No! Gah. Thank you for shielding me, Scarol. Great, just great. More rotten luck. Scarol, Scarol, wake up! You freakish blob! I'll teach you to hurt a friend of mine. No, Kyle, stop. You mustn't touch it directly. No, ah, take this. What the hell? My hand's covered in mud? Ah, I can't get it off. Kyle, are you alright? This is not looking good at all. More and more of them are appearing. Lord Duvade, look at that. Yo! This is the... I remember Nether Beast 2 from Summer Night 5. These are... This is the thing, I think, from Summer Night 5, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Oh, I don't like the look of this development at all. Where did he even come from? Perrier feels big danger now. Is he the boss of these monsters? I'm thinking, yeah. And that means the only way to end this is to beat him to smithereens. This is, um... This is, um, your idol when he got merged, I think, with the, uh, with his summon. Spoiler alert for someone I find. Oh, no. Yeah, Erst. Defeat the degenerate Erst. And that's why probably Fault is being forced into this fight. That's what I assume, because he's, he's a full character. What's with that guy? Just the sight of him gives me goosebumps. I agree. Every instinct I have is screaming to not get too close. Bro, Scarrow, are you okay? To be honest, no, but we can patch up old Kyle once we've taken it. Taking out Dumpty Pants over there. Pshhh. This feeling, not normal. Losing courage will cause heart to give way. The only way out of this one is to fight. But fight smart with this, with this one. He's all kinds of dangerous. <sighs> That's insane. I can't believe he's appeared. I don't like it. What's around us? There's a lot of not cool things. Here goes. 
Give me a sec. I'll be ready to go again soon. Here he comes. My turn. That's a wrap. Time to pull out my game. Your turn. Jeez, 43 off of him. That was that did not take hurt very much. Um, I'd rather heal. Yeah, good thing I healed then. Here it goes. I feel like there's more of them for some reason. How do you miss on me? Showtime. And I can't use my spare slide? What? That actually takes a lot more than I thought. I want to combine with him. Let's do this antimatter thing. Both of them. Teensy bit? Power 70 on this one. He'll kill him. But then he'll kill her. I really don't want to lose her right now. So I'm just gonna heal. Just relax up. You're dead. Ow. Can I switch you out? Because I don't want him. Uh, he has to be in the party. Which is stupid. You're dead. Hang in there. Uh, can 
you kill this thing? This kills it, but I don't want to hit any of our guys. I think that doesn't hit them, I hope. Okay. There you go. Alright. Yes! That's what I want. Alright. This is all you. Take that! Alright. Showtime! Oh, come on! I believed in you, and you missed one of the vital hits. You know what? Let's awaken. Why not? We haven't used it in a bit. Best point. Best time to do it now. Um... Rock Rush. Done. Whew. That was not a piece of cake, folks. How we survived that, I don't know. <sighs> we managed to drive them away. I've never seen enemies like that before. The stream of constantly changing challenges is getting so old already. Who or what was that strange person leading the pack of monsters? Was he another type of Zero? It seems that your guess is as good as anyone's here. This place is growing dark and full of terrors. Hey wait, what happened to the new guy? That Scarrow or something? I don't see him around. He must have slipped away in the battle. In the battle. That's an assassin for you. Quick to find and use an oil any opening. But he was quite badly injured and needs treatment. I'm actually more than a little worried. Both of you come quickly. Kyle is... All right. Kyle. Oh, uh, uh, look at that. Kyle's fist is being eaten away by the mud. Yeah, that was the stuff that was just... um, What was it? It eats away on spirit energy or something like that. It, it's horrible. It's what turned Earth basically into... What happened to him? Just hang in there, bro. No one touch it. The substance consumes all flesh it comes into contact with, no matter how briefly. There's no end to it. So you're saying Kyle's going to be devoured by this thing? No, it's trying to take him over. It wants to control him and then infect others and multiply. Well, he might as well be consumed then, because you're saying he'll become a monster anyway. Everyone, please step back. I'm going to try something. Our wings of light purify this evil that has sullied our brother. Gah! Ah! It's useless. That thing would just devour your magic and spread further. An angel's miracle has no effect on it. What then? It's something even more base than the original sin, Kazor. Huh? There's no choice but to amputate his hand, along with the infected portion before it spreads further. Amputate his hand? Isn't that a little extreme? Let's not act rashly. Would you rather Kyle turn into that monster you saw just now? That is where he's headed. Huh. No, wait. Allow me to try one more thing before you take that step. I'll excise the infected parts using some strings. It may hurt a little bit, but at least he will live. Gah! Excision complete. Now, what to do with the remains of the operation? I'll seal it up. I'll seal it up in a barrier right away. Magna, Taurus, help me. Of course. Anything you need. Oh, wings of light heal the wounds of the combatants. Gah. I've healed the injuries. You just need to get plenty of rest to make sure you recover. Yeah. No problem. And thanks, Almer. Brother, are you sure you're okay now? Yeah, but... I didn't think I'd get so badly injured by just throwing a punch. <laughs> thanks for the help, Ist. You've got my vote for Overseer of the Year. It's lucky that worked. The existence of that substance is beyond my jurisdiction. A virus, as it were. I'll be honest, I cannot guarantee that it will go so well the next time. I hope everyone remembers that. So now we have another deadly enemy, and this time you can lose your life by merely touching it. Great. 
There's no way I'm becoming a part of that monster mob. No way. We need to think of a way to deal with them before another encounter. We should also consider how to deal with that strange man who was leading those monsters around. I met some new friends, but the happiness I felt didn't last long. An unknown man and some monsters that corrode with just a touch showed up unexpectedly. It seems like a crazy parade of bad encounters, and even worse developments when we least expect it. <sighs> well, will I really be able to help everyone go back to their original worlds? I just don't know. Amu, of course. They're literally perfect for one another. Having more people around is fun, but there's gotta be a limit. The endless barrage of questions is exhausting. No one's gonna find me up here. I need a little time to myself to relax. Raj, are you there? Amu, what are you doing up here? Looking for you. You're terrible, Raj. Huh? Terrible? What are you talking about? If you were going to sneak out, you should have told me. When they couldn't find you, they turned all their attention and questions on me. Oh, <laughs> sorry about that. So, what are you doing up here anyway? I was actually looking for you and trying to get a little breathing room. I'm not so good with big crowds myself. I'm assuming you're up here because you were overwhelmed and needed some quiet time too. The funny thing is, I understand. When I want to be alone, I'll always go to the rooftop of my house to think. Really? Yes. This is obviously a little different from mine. But the scenery from this height is the best. Why didn't you climb your own roof then? I certainly could have, but... I came here looking for you, so we could... talk. Talk? Yes. We spoke a little when we first met, but I was hoping to get a little more one-on-one -on -one time. And that's why you came all the way here? What if I wasn't even here? Ist said we led more or less the same lives, remember? So, knowing that, I only had to analyze my own behavior pattern to deduce where you might be. That's kind of scary. What else are you deducing? And well, if you weren't here, I would have just gone back. It's no big deal. But we really are alike down to the shape of our houses and the way we seek solitude to think. Are we really so similar? I know that we've been leading the same kind of lives, but... Think about it. Even our partners look exactly alike. Not to mention the towns and buildings within them. Yeah, hard to deny that. You've got a point or ten there. But I'm glad that you're here. Well, huh? Where did that come from? You know how we were alone before we met each other, right? I was kind of sad to be the only one in this world. I understand that. I used to wonder if there were other people around too. Now that you're here, that means I'm not alone anymore. So, thanks for that, Amu. Why thank me? I'm just as glad you're here too. Hey, Amu, you think we can shake hands? I read about it in a book. It's kind of a sign of friendship. Sounds kind of unsanitary. Have you read about germs? Why do we need to shake hands to be friends? Come on, it's not every day you meet someone who's been through the same stuff. Let's bring that tradition here. So, a handshake, huh? I... Friends forever, Amu. I'll look out for you, and you look out for me. Yes, the same to you, Raj. Uh, Raj? You can let go now. You're squeezing too hard. It's starting to hurt. Whoa, 
sorry. When I thought of how I'm not alone anymore, I couldn't help but put a bit of strength into the handshake. Chapter 15, Silhouette of Thanatos? Secret implement vacuum? What? Did she really just suck the black liquid off of him? The nether? Wow. Wow, where was she in Summer Night 5 with that stuff? Wow, she's so, like, powerful, but, like, just doesn't care.
So, I'm gonna end it here, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, scratch it with a friend. Um, all that good stuff. I want to fight a little bit around uh, before we start more main story stuff. Um, but yeah, uh, next time, we'll see what happens to the group on the next part and what we're gonna do next. Uh, the Nether Beasts are here. Um, the evil, um, well, not evil, it, particularly, not technically, uh, but. Erst is here. A lot of stuff is going on. I'm excited to see what happens. But um, I'll leave it here. See you guys later.